Tonkat fans and welcome to yet another edition of Tonkat TV. It's time to get connected. We are the Haywood High School Audiovisual Department and we are excited to be bringing you news from Haywood High School. Our first segment is called Crazy Halls of Haywood. This segment of Crazy Halls is called Finish the Lyrics. I'm DJ Taylor and I'm with Officer Jones. Lena Thomas. And today we're playing Finish the Lyrics. Hop up at the bed. Turn my swag on. Took a look in the mirror and said, what's up? <laughs> I'm DJ Taylor. I'm with Jenna Lewis. And we're playing Finish the Lyric. Hop up at the bed. Turn my swag on. <laughs> Took a look in the mirror and said, what's up? <laughs> I'm with Destiny. And today we're playing Finish the Lyric. Hop up at the bed. With my swag on. I'm DJ Taylor, I'm with Zach, Deja, Tara. And we're playing Finish the Lyrics. Hop up at the bed. Turn my swag on. <laughs> Take a look in the mirror and say, What's up? What's up? Yeah, I'm getting money. I'm getting money. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I'm with Alexis Mann, Tamara Thomas. And we're playing Finish the Lyrics. Hop up at the bed. I'm DJ Taylor. I'm with Coach Nikki. And today we're playing Finish the Lyric. Hop up at the bed. Put my swag on. <laughs> Tay. And today we're playing Finish the Lyric. Take you on a ride in my big green tractor. We can go slow. Or we can go faster. <laughs> I'm with Miss Joe Cut. And today we're playing Finish the Lyric. Take you on a ride. On my big green tractor. We can go slow. We can go faster. Down through the hill. <laughs> Down by the holler. I'm DJ Taylor. I'm with Carissa. Imani. And we're playing Finish the Lyrics. Take me on a ride. On my big green tractor. <laughs> we can go slow. Or we can go faster. I'm with Sky Green. And today we're playing Finish the Lyrics. Take you on a ride On my big green tractor We can go slow Or make it go faster Down through the hill <laughs> Out to the pasture As long as I'm with you It, it really don't, don't matter, matter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with Coach Nikki, And today we're playing Finish the Lyric Take you on a ride in my Car <laughs> I'm DJ Taylor I'm with Iverson And we're playing Finish the Lyrics Take you on a ride in my big green tractor. We can go slow or we can go faster down through the wood or down through the pasture. As long as I'm with you, it really don't matter. <laughs> this next segment is called Tomcat Tips. This week, we will be focusing on healthy eating tips. Healthy eating tips. Number one, try to limit foods like cookies, candy, frozen desserts, chips, and fries, which often have a lot of sugar, unhealthy fat, and salt. Number two, for a quick snack, try recharging with fruit or veggies. Number three, bring a healthy snack from home instead of eating out of the vending machines. Number four, try to drink as much water as possible or drink low sugar, no calorie drinks. By following these simple tips, you will be well on your way to a healthy lifestyle. Here's this week's sample ACT question. Do your best to answer it and see if you get it right. Good luck. Every episode, we will choose a Tomcat Spotlight, which will feature a student or teacher. This week, we will be spotlighting our foreign exchange students, Astrid Lance and Victor Hendrickson. Oh wait, that's me. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Avery and I'm here with Victor from the Netherlands and Astrid from Germany and I have a few questions for y'all. 
What was your first thought on coming to America? Well, my first thought was, at first I was pretty excited to go, but then I found out I was going to Brownsville. <laughs> so, um, that was quite a cult cultural shock for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ashton, what about you? Um, I was excited and kind of nervous, like how family is and if I find friends and everything. Yeah. What is one thing you miss from home? I miss troop waffles. Troop waffles are like sort of Dutch cookies with honey in between it, and they're so good. Ashton, what is one thing you miss from home? I kind of miss the food too, and yeah. Mm -hmm. So far, what is your favorite part about American culture? Well, I think the people here in Brownsville and Tennessee. I, I haven't really seen, uh, um, I haven't really met people from other states, but I think the people from Brownsville are really hospitable and nice to me. And um, I really like that about the American culture. Okay, Astrid, what about you? Uh, I think we are really friendly and speak with you. and You're welcome there. That's good. Okay, Okay, Victor, can you introduce yourself in your own language? Yes, I can. Um, ik ben Victor Hendriksen. Ik ben 18 jaar oud. Ik ga naar Haywood High School in Brownsville in Amerika. Ik heb het hier heel erg naar mijn zin. En... Um, Ja, dat was het eigenlijk wel. <laughs> Oké. Okay. Astrid, can you introduce yourself in your own language? Ja. Als het jij denkt, ik ben Astrid, ik ben 15 jaar oud en ik kom uit Duitsland. En ik ben daar vier jaar oud en ik ben in Brownsville. En ja, ik voel het terecht. What is your biggest difference from your country and the United States? Um, I would say transportation. Here in the United States, a lot of people... Well, the people, they basically do everything by car. While in the Netherlands, we take uh, bicycles. For example, I, I go on my bicycle to school. I don't even have my driver's license. Um, and we take uh, public transport, like trains, to, for example, a bigger city. So we don't really use our cars. Okay, Astrid, what about you? I think, like, we can drive with 18 in Germany, and that's different. T, you can drive 16. Mm -hmm. Okay, how long have y'all been in America, and how long do y'all plan on staying? Um, I've been in America since the 1st of February. I went to, s I arrived in St. Louis, and I'll stay until the mid of June. I haven't booked my flight back yet, but... <laughs> um, I'm here since August, and I stay until June the 2nd. Victor, what is your favorite part about Haywood High School? My favorite part is audio-visual class. <laughs> Ashton, what is your favorite part about Haywood High School? I mean, I really like the lunch and like the people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, thank you all. Internet in Interactions is our next video. This is a time in the show where you get to enjoy the videos from the internet. This week's Internet Interactions is called Dude Perfect Videos. Perfect. It's ping pong toss to frisbee time. Here we go. Way up above these city lights, there's a higher calling on all our lives. Let's live to love, not just survive. There it goes like a lightning flash that gets past and don't go back. That shot was lit, fam. Dryer element. Beautiful. This is the floating ball bow and arrow blaster. Oh, hello. This will be swinging and this will be pinging. Oop, missed. And now for our HHS Club Organization Spotlight. This week we'll be spotlighting ROTC.
The mission of Air Force Junior Reserved Officer Training Corps is to develop citizens of character dedicated to serving their nation and community. The objective is to educate and train, promote community service, instill responsibility, character and self-discipline, and provide instruction in air and space fundamentals. Cadets will develop the following core values. Integrity first, service before self, and excellence in all we do. The requirements to be a member of Air Force Junior ROTC is as follows. You must be in ninth through 12th grade, a citizen of the United States, or an alien admitted for permanent residence or a foreign cadet, physically fit, enrolled in and attending a regular course of instruction in the school and selected by the Air Force Junior ROTC instructor in coordination with the principal. You will also receive your credit in wellness, PE, American government, and personal finance. Every episode we will choose a Tomcat Athlete Spotlight, which will feature our school athletes. This week we are spotlighting our baseball and softball teams. Hi, I'm Riley Simmons and I'm here with your Tomcat Athlete Spotlights. Today we have Kirsten Porch, Kaylin Johnson, JD Hines, Sky Green. Oh <laughs> Our first question is, how long have you been playing softball or baseball? Since I was four. Since I was three. Since I was three. Since I was five. Our next question is, what's the most memorable game you've played in? Covington, Covington freshman, freshman year. year. Just the county sophomore year. Our next question is, what is something you will always remember about playing for the Tomcats? Uh, whether you win or lose, you still got your teammates. Brotherhood. Winning. You will always have sisters behind you. Okay. What is your favorite memory of high school? High school musical. Making it to state and signing day. Going to state, hitting my first home run. Went in homecoming queen and hit my first home run. Okay, next question. Our final question is, what is your favorite thing about your season? DBG. The support, locking down third base. This has been another edition of Tomcat Athlete Spotlight. Thank you athletes for putting points on both your report card and on the scoreboard. Yeah. Up next is a little something we like to call Brain Break. This week's Brain Break is called Avi's Dance Along. And our last segment is called Haywood Happenings. In this section of the show, we will be bringing you school announcements and Haywood High School events for the upcoming two weeks. So pay close attention, we wouldn't want you to miss anything. Today and tomorrow, the softball team will play Northside and Jackson. DACA is currently competing in the State Career Development Conference in Chattanooga. They will be back home tomorrow. Tomorrow, March 9th, ROTC will be hosting their annual military ball at the National Guard Armory. On Monday, March 11th, softball plays at Fayetteware and baseball plays at JCS. On Tuesday, March 12th, 
the juniors will be taking the ACT. Also, baseball will play at USJ. Softball will play at home against Middleton. And the veterinary science students will be going on a trip to UT Martin. Softball will have a game at USJ on Wednesday, March 13th. On Thursday, March 14th, tennis will play at Covington, softball will play at Northside, and baseball will play at Southside. Also, ROTC will be traveling to Columbus Air Force Base in Mississippi through the 16th. On Monday, March 18th, tennis will play at Munford, softball will play at Cordova, and baseball will play at South Gibson. On Tuesday, March 19th, tennis will play South Gibson at home. Softball will play Bolivar at home, and baseball will play South Gibson at home. On Wednesday, March 20th, report cards will be issued. The FCCLA will be in Chattanooga for the leadership conference through the 22nd, and baseball will play at Northside. On Thursday, March 21st, softball will play Ripley at home. On Friday, March 22nd, softball will be competing in the Buffalo River Spring Fest tournament. We hope you enjoyed this edition of Tomcat TV. It's time to get connected. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.